Hi, how to extract the barcode numbers from a PDF. So in this PDF example, I've got a barcode 39 font here with some numbers in it. So to do the extraction, I need some software called PDF Data Extractor. You can download the free trial from my website. The link is in the description of this video. So once you have that installed and put and running on your machine, you just drag and drop the file into the source file box and click analyze and that will show the barcode number there which is the actual barcode and any text there so to extract that information you just click on right mouse output on font because we know it's a barcode 39 font and then I'm just going to select the top one match output so you can see it's got barcode 39 in there as a font name. So horizontal is just position across on the page. If it moves around, then you can add more range to it. So for example, 80 to 100 across, and then vertical is, is the position down on the page. So it's 714 to 714 at the moment. So I'm going to do um, 700 to 730, because there's only one barcode on there anyway. So. It's good to match it. Press return. So that's now all set. Now output order is position in the Excel file output. And that's all I need to do. So now I can output to a report CSV. I can type in XLS to do it to an Excel file. Or XLSX, for example. I'm going to do it to CSV. Click process. So it's output that one page. If there's other pages with same position font, then it will do that as well. So you can see that it's output the file name first, and then the barcode, which is over here. It's a slight little problem there. We just need to change the output order to one. Run it again. Now see it's in my header. So that is a barcode number. And that's the file name that I've put in. So if I want to run multiple files, I can do that also. You can also change the header to whatever you want. So if you're going to set up header on output file, you can see it's got file name, comma barcode. And also you've got other extra fields like the output file title, which is what I'm doing for the first column. But you can do all these other things as well. So now we're gonna run it in batch, click on batch, prepare list. So I've got two files in here. You can move the files around, action, move down. So it's going to run those two files. Click close and then click process. Yes. So it's processed two files. Now I'm going to open output. So I've got the first one there that barcode and then the second PDF of the barcode so I can open that in Adobe you can actually see the number but that is the number of the barcode in there and it's that simple to do give it a try mm -hmm.